Hello ladies and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm coming to you with a project chair and this is the wedding album which I finished for my client. So this is the cover and I um, put some of this mesh. It is white and golden and sorry for my nail. I need to redo it because it's broke. So I glued it on top of the paper and then I used those metal corners which were gifted to me by uh, Cindy, uh, my friend Cindy. Then I put a lace applique down here, a wedding applique, a um, wooden embellishment uh, which I painted a little bit with white so that it could match the album. Then here I have some leaf um, uh, paper shapes paper shapes <laughs> I don't know so here I have roses then wild orchid craft um, uh, leaves then here are some cutouts too then this is a handmade flower of mine which I showed once in one of my tutorials no I haven't showed this one I think I need to so um, yeah just a bling center then this flower was gifted to me by Bridget uh, who is Shoe Princess 1, and this is a Wild Orchid Crafts flower too. Then here I uh, used some thicker stickers in gold, which I bought and just um, put down the date when they have their wedding. I used those tiny little doilies, which were gifted to me by Pat. Thank you so much, Pat. Um, which I thought they matched very well with the cover. And then I put some bling in the middle and... Um, the back is just plain so here you can see the mesh and yeah so this is the cover then I closed it with a lace with lace so then here I put the initials of the wedding couple then here is a wedding couple then here are just some photo mats and here I use some uh, borders, like my, my punch border, my border punch. Oh my god, I'm not supposed to say punch, right? My border shaper. <laughs> so here is a very cute um, pattern on this format. Then here I use some stickers and put the word kiss. And in between the... Uh, spaces as like in the spaces between the pages I put some lace trim so then you open this one up and this one and then here you have lots of space for photos then here is a big photo mat and I love this paper which I found in my local scrapbooking store I was so excited and I thought it was perfect for a wedding album so then in the pages we have those big tabs where they can put their um, photos on and journal on the back and um, I just use some lace to do the pullouts. Then here I punched out a um, corner which was gifted to me by a uh, Sandy, who is Decorate Your Life uh, here on YouTube. I mean, you all know those ladies which gifted all these beautiful goodies to me. Then here I used a sticker with some rings and I made a little booklet. Just a tiny one. So they can put a photo down here and they can put photos in the booklet or journal. Or Then I used my border, another border punch here. Then here's another space for um, for a photo to tuck down, like so. Maybe I will keep that there so they know. So then here is a photo mat. And here I use this beautiful paper. You can see I used it throughout the album. And this has like embossed roses and it's glittered. And then I have the same kind with butterflies. So these were the ones which I used. And I'm sorry, I'm a little bit sick. I got a cold so for my nose and everything. So here I put a waterfall and then a sticker which says remember. And these papers were gifted to me by Beate. 
who is uh, Strandnixel 1, Strandnixel 1, sorry for adjusting the camera again. And then here I just tied some, uh, I just put a little twine to, or what is it called, I don't know, <laughs> um, to close this up. Then here is the next big photo mat. And then on this side, I just left this one plain. Here is a die cut butterfly. Oh my god, I said it again. Um, <laughs> so sorry. So I hope um, YouTube won't mind. So um, this says yes in German. Then here's uh, again this wedding couple. And then here I tied a little bow and put a fling piece in the center. Sorry for my camera being blurry, but I'm so sorry I can't do nothing about it. So then here, this one says we say yes. Then here's another photo mat and lots of space for photos. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh no, I didn't want this to happen. So carefully slide this back. <laughs> and... Then here's like this belly band die cut, and then here's a little tag where they can journal on the back. These papers were all gifted to me by Big Arthur. And these have magnetic closures. So then here I use my little um, lady, which I love so much with the butterflies flying from her hand all the way to the other side. And here's a little um, floral kind of. This one says so happy together. Um, this is the tab for that one. And then this is like a window. When you open it up, it looks like this. I put some of those action embellishments which I bought. Um, for weddings and this is moments and then here I just put some lace down and I mean with this paper you don't really need to embellish a lot because the paper is so pretty itself I think there is no need to put a whole lot of, of you know die cuts or flowers or embellishing on the paper so this is the back of the side and then here is a heart, just a flower, some floral paper shapes. <laughs> and then here, this is the photo mat. And here is another paper shaped uh, thing, <laughs> which says love. And these are from those small cards, like with the folds on the side, but really mine, like, you know, the card to fold it, it doesn't really work. So, yeah, then this one says forever in German, here are some leaves, um, I punched out these with my with a flower punch of mine and then created those little flowers with the bling center, then here's the other flower, then here you um, can flip both of these up, and here's a little wedding dress which I want to make it made uh, make it look like it's hanging from this border so um i thought this is cute then here's another photo mat in another corner to tuck the photo mat behind so they can put uh, photos on the back and then cook a uh, journal on the mats or put photos on the mats too so this is the tab for this one <coughs> Oh, I'm so sorry, I'm sick. I, this cold is uh, getting on my nerves. So here is this little, I don't know what to call it. Please let me know. <laughs> I always tend to forget the word. Then here are more photo mats. Tuck spots for photo mats. I made two for the front and one bigger one for the back. I don't know why my camera is so so blurry I don't know I'm so sorry ladies I hope you can see then here I put a little dove then here uh, are also two doves and then this trim was gifted to me by Bridget 2 my shoe princess 1 <clears throat> 
And this is what I mean. Um, oh yeah, this is a journaling spot. I just, I tucked it down, I forgot. And then here is the, a flower so they can write something down here. Then here I, it says uh, just married and then this little cupid. This is just plain and here is a photo mat behind this. And then here's the big photo mat inside of the page. And on the last page, <clears throat> um, I just created like a fold. You can really see here's a wedding couple too. And I punched this border and then just, you know, they can put uh, pictures on both sides. So yeah, and this is the bag made with love for sure and yeah this book is just plain so this is my uh, wedding album oops <laughs> which i was working on and i really like how it came out uh please let me know in the comment sections uh what you think um thank you all for watching and see you in my next one bye